right through. Remember, says you say, I'm a father, let me stay, so, you know. So, from birth, I uno born me, so. Me never asked to be this child. Me could have be like Fen, because Fen don't make none trouble, her. So, remember, you know, two child right here. Remember, make sure, show this. See, this is Fenice. Two child right here. Same mother, same father. <laughs> you look at your face, boy. You're your French. <laughs> I know. Same mother, same father. She, no worries. Not nobody are. I live also a tub dog, but she stand up. She come like dad say. <laughs> she not saying a, a word. word. No, no, she no. She not saying a word. She don't make nothing about her, not no stress her. Me, me toe to toe in. <laughs> <laughs> me toe to toe in. Right through. If you call me name, but at the end of the day, no. You know, have to give it to me because. I try me, try me answer the people that make me not bury it because if some of them, if you leave it to some of them, they would have cover me long, long time. Yeah, me have to stand up for myself. Me have to talk up for myself. Them tell life on me, them stab me, them chop me, them do everything. Me have to come out and say, no, let me tell you how it go, and I say it go. So I have to talk to talk. Me have to talk for myself. Me no big, none at all. Me little. Me little. <laughs> yeah, so we have to answer some of them. You don't have to answer. Sometimes you don't have to answer. Mama, that you tell me all my life, say me not to answer, but me have to answer. Mm -hmm. See, somebody say, I saw we Leo stay, us Leos. My mother Leo too, you know, but me know my mother is a different Leo. Maybe true, my mother get older now. Maybe my mother terrible when she lick and she not and talk. But. I don't know, my mother is a Leo. I'm no, you're not a Leo, you're yeah, past Leo. Leo. She, um, she passed Leo and Nicholas is a Leo. She born August, my mom born August, me born August, but she had a Leo. She rolled over to the Virgo. Yeah, but I guess when I get older, mm -hmm. we need to teach them interview. We don't love foolishness. <laughs> but yeah. They say, so which of your kids are like you? Which of which my kids? I don't think none of them still like me or I don't see it the yet. The boy. The boy. You think so? Yes. I'm very outspoken. My mother said Nicholas very outspoken. But I outspoken too. But fierce I think, think it, yeah. Oh, so since as we had talked about um, kids before, I forget. Remember the other day when I was doing um, <clears throat> flow? I was doing flow innovation conference when I was teaching people about business and I was talking about where I'm coming from. I told you guys about my mom and how she was an entrepreneur when I was little. She used to sell, she used to hustle. Um, she do everything, you know, that's possible, um, you know, to make money. And that's where I got my, my first teaching from. Um, I was telling you guys about chicken food. So I'm going to make my mother tell you no. Give her to look at instance. Because no, when I lick her, I frack her. You see how I stay now? No, you and I become me an artist, make me stay so. Mm -hmm. So some people might say, I choose your name Spice. No, I from me little before Spice. This is just me. Not no, no, no other than I make on being an artist. I've always been this person as a child. So as I tell you no, I, I told them on... Flow, me I go tell Uno no my fans because I know all I want to dip on it. So me we go into the story. So when I was younger, my mother used to sell chicken foot. But what which was one of one way of income, mm -hmm. making money. Cause my mom used to have a cook shop, she used to have a shop at Float Clarence Beach, straight hustler, working, making money all along. So she used to sell chicken foot at the house. So I was about what eight. Eight? Yes. I was about eight years old. Seven, eight. Seven or eight. Mm -hmm. My mother said I was about seven or eight. So, my mother said chicken foot. So, for those of you who don't know chicken foot, we eat the foot of the chicken because the people in America don't really understand chicken, chicken foot. Yeah, we, we buy some fewer there. Yeah. Yes, you do use it yes. in our soup? Yes. You don't use it yet? Go wait there. It's still there. I want to show them because yes. some people from America don't really know the foot of, the foot of a, like chicken foot. People don't eat chicken foot but we but Ma we use the boiled soup we curry it and we chew it yeah and more and go feed it. you know so go no come on and show and i'm jamaican alone they pan the instagram live right. so me i go show no <coughs> so we we, we we curry it we, we, we cook soup we roast through it we cook it in 
Stew peas. Stew peas, yes. Yes. So me, me used to go to buy the chicken for that boilers. Jamaica boilers. Jamaica boilers. Jamaica boilers, big up yourself. So remember I used to um them call it chicks. See somebody said they call it the chicken claw. Okay. So them call it chicken claw. See my sister gone for the chicken foots because I went to it's in the other fridge, um Fen. Two fridge may have. Oh it go. <laughs> So anyway, so, I went to the Jamaica store as me tell you know what day when we get the Milo and so. So I see chicken foot, but I've never seen chicken foot in Atlanta. So I grab my chicken foot and I say, no, I have to buy this to my mother. Because I'm a pescatarian. I no longer eat like meat and stuff. But my mother, she eat her little chicken foot and stuff. She not eat everything, but me know that she love boiled soup with chicken foot. And me and her have a history of chicken foot because she also used to sell the chicken foot. Right? So I take up the... the it freeze up. Yeah. Me take up the, the, the chicken foot. Them can't see it. Jesus and peace. Mm -hmm. They can't see it. So anyway, the claw of the chicken foot will look like finger. <laughs> <laughs> Most of you from America don't really understand. I don't want to eat them something here. But yeah. Me take up the chicken foot when I go in at the something, right? And I said, no man, I have to buy this to my mother. I really, really come see um chicken foot. Chicken foot at Atlanta. Mama I forgot to buy some nice soap. Anyway, when I was about seven years, years old, my mother used to sell the chicken foot. So everybody have an idea of oh, one chicken foot. Small. Somebody said run some water over it. <laughs> they want to see it. Okay. Yeah. So, you know, all the chicken foot small. Somebody say, wash it down. <laughs> you know, all the chicken foot small. So, my mother sell the chicken foot. So, she teach me how to wear the chicken foot in the scale since I was a child. Because that's, you know, how we make our live, how we make we live in. So, my day one now, and one lady come at the house, and the lady say, she want pound a chicken foot. Was it a pound a pound a oh, chicken foot? She said she want pound a chicken foot. Mother go wash it off phone. Jesus space. See the chicken foot here. This are the chicken foot story. <laughs> so this are the chicken foot. So for those of you who don't know, I eat this. So anyway, we used to sell this to make money, right? And. My mother now, my mother used to buy it from boilers, as she say. Put it nice thing, sis. My mother used to buy it from chicken boilers and... From Jamaica boilers. From Jamaica boilers. And carry it home and then would have weigh it out in a little, no, little bag. We, we, we would shake off the feather, wash it off and scarl it to her and then we strip it. We are your dad. All right, you hear that? So, so, so your dad used yeah, to we used to dip it in the hot water for scarlet it off. Yes. Anyway, so we used to sell that and people would have come out of us and come buy the chicken foot and would have wait and sell it to them. So a lady, long story short, the lady come now and she say, Pawn a chicken foot. Me now, seven years old, go at the veranda and we have a scale where we would have take up the chicken foot and we it in the scale. So I put some chicken foot on the scale. And you know, you look on the scale for see the weight. Put two little more chicken foot. My mama said, you know, me and them little. So I took off one, one chicken foot and put on the scale. That's why my mother must up the road. It up the lane or something like that. No, I go market. I went market and come back and I meet the lady. Okay. My <laughs> mother said, Mama, remember? You remember? Yeah. So far. I tell you the story because I tell you the lady said. Well, I don't know. I'm going to sit on the side of mama. The lady said to me say, when I was coming. Yo, the only little girl down there, me I tell you, she don't easy. Me buy the pound of chicken for can't tell her if you give me one. Wait, 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 wait. So anyway, the lady now she says so she want pound of chicken foot. So I'm wear the chicken foot. Me give the lady a cup of chicken foot. The chicken, the scale go over one. So me take off back one of the chicken foot. Here the lady, little girl. They really take off back one of the chicken food. Put back your chicken food. Me say, lady, a pound of chicken food. You, buy. you never buy a pound and quarter. <laughs> me say, the woman begs. The woman begs. Me say, look here, a pound of chicken food. You buy. 
you never buy pound and quarter. So me take off back the one chicken foot. So when she see my mother now, she go tell me, she go, yeah, she go tell my mother. She must say my mother go beat me. A profit. We need the profit. <laughs> <laughs> when woman tell us the mama, but, 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 <laughs> when she see her, when she say, oh, the, the little girl down there, she not easy how she dry eyes so. <laughs> look at me one chicken foot and look at woman say you know you buy pound a pound you buy you never buy pound and quarter. Seven, I was seven years old, yeah. seven years old. What a pound you buy? I mean, need my mother profit for go to school and for get little money. You crazy? Me can't give her not even one chicken foot. But 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 they used to keep training. I me mean, used to have to go buy the go buy the chicken foot and go buy. I think I used to sell coconut oil at that time too. We really? So, I'm um, so <laughs> yeah. I'm a girlfriend. No. I'm a girlfriend. No. Fenny's CR dear. I'm a girlfriend. Hey, Hi. I'm on Instagram. I'm a girlfriend. Yeah. 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 You stop the left friend with you and go get the chicken foot and go get stuff like that. All right. Yeah. I'm a girlfriend. The first time Penny's get a beating from me, I'll give it to her right now. See her there. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. No matter that she's big now, I'm pregnant. It's me grow her. Yeah. Me grow her because see my mother here, my mother used to work very hard. As me tell you no all the while no no I wanna see me now just I tell you no I first when I see my mother so she can't tell you no fear I said my mother used to work very hard. Very hard. She used to leave and go do her little thing and me you now take it take the initiative. And be a big woman in the place. <laughs> I take care of Fen and take care of Mayo. I had a little brother when near Mayo. Me grow them. Fenny is now the first lick she get from me. <laughs> cartel lick she gets. That one there? Yeah, no. It's a cartel lick she gets. <laughs> it's a cartel lick she gets. So we, we used to live for one house, two bedroom, and rare, rare. Me is a strict mother, you know. No, that's why I see sometimes when people judge me, me just laugh. I am a very strict mother. When it comes to book, you have to take book. When it comes to housework and them something there, you have to do your housework. So me leave this little girl now until I say take her book. Me go away. When me come back at the house. Oh, oh, the song go. <laughs> you must <laughs> stay back and you get a rafted lick. Oh, this cartel song go. I don't like, want for me. It was like, uh, but I had a long time cartel then. A cartel song that me hear a play. <laughs> After me leave this little girl in the house for do her school work. But can't yeah, remember the cartel. Well, whining song. Yeah, but it was a whining song. Anyway, me can't remember which cartel. A cartel song that me hear a play. You know what me do? I tip on my toe <laughs> and go round at the back of the house because true me know say if me open the front door, the girl I go hear me and stop and turn off the song. Me just walk go round at the back when me know say a room they round at the other side and lift up the little window in our room. Mm. Girl, I practice for wine. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> what I <is> say? <laughs> that is so embarrassing. Mm -hmm. The girl I practice the wine. You're crazy. Mm -hmm. Me and your mother. Me. <laughs> Yo. Where's Stephen? I get some leak the deer. I said, I couldn't even believe. Because my friend, Nina, because she just coming out the door, I said, Oh, I whine, I whine. Yo, I get some so leak. I said, Why do I whine? Oh, I whine some leak for her. Yeah, so she's she pregnant now. She turned big man and she married. Crazy, I give her some lick. <laughs> but she hurt for wine. <laughs> yeah. So, that was Finn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I love my family. I live for them. Yes. Love my mom to death. Mm. Me, from, from, from the first money me I won, me I mean, as a matter of fact, this career part of me have because I'm a mother. Because to be honest, I got an opportunity to leave Jamaica when I was nine. 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 Yeah. Yeah. My father died when I was nine. And um Okay. 
Yes. Yeah, daddy dead when me are nine. Yes. And Fen never born yet. Fen don't know her father, by the way, guys. Um, my mom was pregnant when my father died, and I think she only found out about the pregnancy. Um, when we got to when, when when he died, and she got to the hospital, right? Mm -hmm. So Fenice never got a chance to meet daddy. Um, <clears throat> but I was saying, my mom is the reason why me even they are Jamaica, come back to Jamaica, and you know because. So when my father died, my grandfather, May Soul, rest in peace, that's my mom's dad, nice man, you know, he gave me the opportunity to go to England. I guess him tell mommy, say, I'm going to send for me or whatever yes, the case may be. you did the glam bright and thing like that, and he said, um... What, you hear what my mother say? Yes. Hold on, hold on, mama. Yes. Mama, hold on. <laughs> say that again? Yes, it, you, you, you're, you're right. Granddad, a letter. And you say, Lick Lan? When you was, think it was five, and she said, Oh, who is this little girl? And I said, Five. And I said, This the girl is five. I'm writing this letter. I'm going to keep it and I'm going to send for her. And she said, um, He sent for you when you was nine. You hear that? I was the little Anne Bright. <laughs> and that little <laughs> mama said again, I was the little Anne Bright. Anyway, so my grandfather sent for me now to come to England. So when I go to England now, that's because my father died. My mom was struggling with, you know, all of us and stuff. So he was like, I'm super bright and I have great opportunities. So he's going to make me go to England. So I went to England. I was living there for a while. I was going to school in England. Yes. But something just never right in my spirit, man. Because I say, because I say, you know, if you take care of Finn. And and may have to go and buy the, 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 the chicken foot and thing like that. So you you, you you tell dad say you want to come back to help me. You hear that? Yes. You mm -hmm. hear that? Because say may have struggle to get with the chicken foot and thing like that. You hear that? So so me, me call one Sunday. We went to the, the phone box and me call you one Sunday and you answer. After your answer. Look at the mama. <laughs> Look at him. After your answer, you say, I want to go, I want to go, I want to go, I go, I want So the moral of the story now, England nice, I be a nice food. I used to them a big food, yeah. Because we, we, we come from humble beginnings, so my mom never had it as much as... You know, my grandfather had it in England. So you're going to this new world as a little girl, dog in the house. When you're there in Jamaica, dog outside. <laughs> dog outside, and you throw a bone, get dog. But, but, and when you go to England, dog in the house with you, dog up in your bed. <laughs> <laughs> but the great part about it is, them give me this grand opportunity, and me just, me just, at all me in my head, me have to go back to Jamaica to help my mother. Yes. Them give me the world. Life was beautiful over there. Like when I say I have everything. Um, write your memoir, Great Spice Official. <laughs> but, 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 but when you come back and, and you, you, you miss the first eggs, the first. I come on in trance then. We are not ready for that bright part there yet. Hold <laughs> on, mama. Let me give them the story properly. Because since we attack. We're not ready for that bright part there yet. <laughs> We are not the mama. We are ready for that partner yet. Yes. So when we go to England now, me I tell them to say, um, me a ball. I tell them say, look here, me love one want everything. <laughs> me like the big food, ha, everything. Oh, it's nice and everything. Me have my own a room in England and everything. When my dad drop me come here, my sister them share the one bed. Me said this nice, you know, this very nice. But I want to go back to Jamaica. <laughs> yes. I want to go back home because I have to help my mother. Me say, look here. All of them pretty suck me up. Like it. But I want to go home go help my mother. I told my grandfather. Me say, look here. Me have to go home and help my mother because my mother one dog at Jamaica. And she have the two pity them, which is Fenice. There. It's where she see me there. <laughs> Every time, that's why she have to take care of my two pity them right now. You know, right through. I said I forgot to help my mother and my little sister and, and brother. And two, and more than two. It was five, five of them at that time. 
Right. Uh, but me just a say, I want to help. The longer one, which the is... The longer one, yes. Fenis and Mayo. Yes. I say, I can't stay here, so sir, I have to go back home. I never stop nag the man until the man send me back to Jamaica because every day, yeah, water. When them there the table with big food, me sit on a ball. What is wrong with you, Grace? Remember, say I have a little British accent in this, so I get it from. Someone don't ever know say me used to live in England. What's wrong with you, Grace? Me want go. Me want go help my mother. Me want go home. I be at that every day. So till the people them end up after send me back to Jamaica. So me I so so spice man. Yes. So spice man. My mother can't tell you no. I start from young as me drop back to Jamaica. No itching. Yeah. So I could tell you about the bright part now. Because I'm not like that part. Don't have to hear me the little bit. I'm bright. Very brilliant. When I drop back at Jamaica now, I used to go to Britain school. So I used to go to Britain school now. Um, the teacher, she... She, she can't pass the exam. She never did the syllabus. She never did the syllabus. She got to repeat and go back to grade four to Mr. Baker class because the syllabus was difficult and she she not gonna pass. She she has to do go do a repeat and she does a go on. That's why me with my like a ball head now. Me I say, Miss, just give me a chance to take the exam now. Because Miss Baker, Miss Baker says she Grace Bright, so she she, she she you have to you have to accept her because she look and bright. So you did pass the first chance, so that was the second chance. It Common entrance. Two, yes, the two chance. And do you go to England, you miss the first one, so you have the last one. So the teacher was saying, so you're not going to pass the last one. So Miss Baker said, yes, she will, she will pass. Give her a chance. And so she gives you the chance. She, she accepts you back in school and you pass. Big up to Miss Baker. Because when I sit the common entrance at Brayton All Age School, I never did the syllabus. I never did the syllabus at all. Me just go sit the common entrance and Miss Baker say, she believe in me. Give me the chance. But 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 I'm a pass. But 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 pass. <laughs> you see, you don't, a lot of things that you don't tell them because they say when you come back, the fridge, when you are selling the chicken for the fridge, they break down. And I couldn't buy that amount of chicken food that I used to buy. Like I used to buy one bag, that one bag was, I think, a 60 pound one in the bag. And through the fridge break down, I could only buy like 20 pound. So I couldn't send you to school for, for, um, for the whole of the week, God has sent you two days, Monday and Tuesday. Because I never have enough money to send you Wednesday and Thursday and Friday. So one day, <laughs> so one day, hear that? One day, hear that? <laughs> one day, no. You said the teacher said, What happened? You're not coming to school. You're not coming to school for three days. What happened? And yeah, 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 um, I think I tell the teacher, I say, my mother didn't have any money to send me to my school. But one day, you now my day home, and I see a cry come. And I said to me, say, me say, what happened? And I said, you said, Mama, I'm not going to pass my exam because I said, you can't send me to school more than two days. And I said, Grace, you will pass your exam. Remember what I said when you come? Mm -hmm. I said, started to pray. <coughs>